Hey friends, today I'm going to be showing you how to make this super easy DIY halter midi dress. Let's get started. For this dress I am using a stretch knit fabric that I folded in half from selvage to selvage and I am using an old t-shirt that I've tucked into the sleeves and cinched in at the waist and I'm cutting around the edge using a half inch seam allowance. For the length I measured from my shoulders down to the length that I wanted it to be and added a one inch hem allowance. I did not cut out the neckline but I folded it in half so that I'll have an even cut on each side. And I'm going to cut out that other side. After that's done, I'm going to unfold it and I'm going to fold down one of the layers of fabric and I'm going to cut out the back neckline of the halter. I'm cutting straight across from the bottom of the armpit and cut that away and once that's cut away I'm going to cut out the front neckline area starting at the bottom of the armpit and I'm curving it up to the top and then I'm going to fold it over and I'm going to use that as a template and cut out the other side so that it's even and once you unfold it, it will be roughly six inches across the top. And then we're going to sew down each side using a zigzag stitch. Now that that's sewn up, we are going to cut off one inch of that top portion. And we're, we're going to hem around the edges, we're going to fold down half an inch all the way around and up the sides and sew using a stretch stitch. And then we're going to cut out the halter piece for the neck. I am cutting a 3 inch strip, you can make it as long as you want it to be. And then I'm leaving it folded in half so that I can section off the portion that I'm going to leave open once I fold it down to sew it. So three inches is where I place my pen so that when I open it up there's a six inch gap which will be the same size as the top of the dress and I'm going to fold that in half and I'm going to sew down the edges and across the top. So now that it's sewn up I am going to turn that tube right side out. I'm using a pencil to help me turn it. I'm placing the pencil right at the top edge and I'm just feeding that tube through the hole to turn it right side out and it's going to come out of the open area that I left with my pins. And then we'll just pull it through the hole and do the other side. I'm using the pin to push out the corners. Cut off any excess on the other side so that you won't have as much bulk when you turn it right side out. And now that it's turned right side out, we're going to attach that piece to the top of the dress. To attach that piece to the top of the dress, we're going to fold those raw edges in and we're going to place the dress inside of that hole and with the raw edges tucked in we're going to top stitch across the top fold in the raw edges place the dress inside and top stitch across the top and then we're going to hem the bottom fold it up half an inch and stretch stitch all the way around and you are done Thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel and I will see you again soon. Goodbye.